Hey! I know jujitsu! I know jujitsu! Oh! Smile for the camera. No! One day this hole appeared in the wall. It's kind of strange. That's a draft. And I can see the other side. Which should be impossible. <laughs> no, please! <gasps> I'm too young to die! Alright y'all, this is Smack with Killer. This is a indie horror game where you play as the sniper and the victim or the target. You know? So with double perspective, just a, a bit of a shake up, you know. But let's go ahead and uh get into it, alright? Well, yeah. this is the address. Oh. Voice acting? Okay. When was the last time Purple Combo did voice acting? Uh uh night. At the gates of hell? That was the last game they dropped, right? Says to take the elevator. Okay. Models wanted. $40 cash up front. I guess there has to be one around here somewhere. I can't believe I'm doing this. How desperate can you get? I mean, what? Uh, like, hold on. Okay. Yeah, it's been a minute. I miss playing games like this. Playing, like, finishing Akamano made me realize, like, how much I like these type, this aesthetic for horror games. It's such a cool aesthetic. Hello? Hello? Anybody home? I saw an ad for Models Wanted. Is anyone here? Ah, guten Tag. They gave me two. Yes, <laughs> you'll be perfect. Follow me, my dear. Oh, brother. Uh, sure, my dear. Modern photography, there's a camcorder. Uh, hey, Hans, how, how are you, brother? Hello, Miss. Uh... Pamela, and your name? Ah, a lovely name. I am Hans, <laughs> but Miss Pamela, names matter little here. No, no, you and I are about to make history. This will be the greatest photo shoot the free world has ever seen. Emphasis on shoot. That's great. And that's only worth forty dollars. <laughs> Miss Pamela, one must not put a price on the changing of a world. Right, of course. Okay, then, uh, where do you want me? Inside the closet lie the tools for the building of a new society. My, uh, what now? The clothes for the photo shoot. Just say that! Please, put them on and then meet me out here and we shall begin. 
Soon, no one will remember my name as Frankenstein, and will soon know me as Hans Photostein. And hopefully forget about the criminal charges. I'm- oh my god, look at that back! Oh my god! First of all, you're not Shakespeare, my G. So don't speak to me all like poetically, like in soliloquies and shit like that. Don't do that, brother. Look at your back, bro. Where you from, Notre Dame? God. Ew. All right. Anyway, why you got plastic on the ground? What? It, what? It, is this a photo shoot for laundry? Forty hey, uh, bucks. Hans? There's no way I'm here, bro. Yes, yes, my dear. He mighty close. Which one of these dresses did you want me to wear? Dress? Dress? No, no, my psychic. No dress. The pillow. Put the pillow underneath your shirt. Uh. Okay. Huh? What? Hello. Underneath my shirt. Where did 40 bucks I ever made? See, what happened to her voice was after this, she actually had a lot of PTSD, so she started smoking a lot. Couldn't really get any sleep. So now she's restless, smoked a lot. That's what happened to her voice. And how are you today? You doing all right? Good, good. Good. <laughs> oh, and by the way, hold on, I wanna talk about something before we get back into this. So, I was on Twitter, I don't normally get on Twitter, but I was on Twitter because I like to look out for horror games that are coming out. So I follow a couple of accounts here and there. I happen to run across, so there's a game that just called, came out called Super Normal, right? And someone posted this, and so basically claiming that the person who made the game didn't pay the voice actors. They used AI art. They're saying that the storyline was uh, plagiarized. And they also said that this person is uh, racist and transphobic. And also, the person who made the game recently put out a post on the 11th, I think it was, saying that they're going to address the allegations and also they're going to have an update for the game. Just to make a connection with other games recently, the person who made Harry Potter is technically, they talk about she was transphobic, right? But you still put out the game, and the game sold like crazy. Because it's a good game. Why is there an issue with separating the art from the artist? That's my only question. Are you able to do that? Can you separate the art from the artist? Like, if y'all found out I was actually the real sniper killer, would y'all still watch my videos? Just let me know in the comments, bro. Just let me know. I just wanted to know. Okay. Now, uh, make your way to the washer and pose for me. Look straight into the camera. Stare into it as you are staring straight into the eyes of your great school bully who has just taken your last nougat bar and tell him um, to... Uh, to... Um, uh, to, to, uh, to go yodel his mother. Yo, I like this voice actor. I don't eat nougat bars. But okay. For the sake of roleplay. And 40 bucks. Uh, Excellent. I wasn't ready. Sorry. Now, uh, now go over to the couch. That was more of a candid photo. Is that what you're going for? Is that the... Okay. And look at it, with the remorse you would feel if you, uh, 
If you had created a monster made from corpses and given it life, inadvertently causing it to destroy a whole village and cause you to flee forever from your homeland. <clears throat> yeah, do that. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You like that? Not the moment of truth. Okay. Halt! Someone is at the door. Okay. Don't lose your energy. <laughs> I shall return. Oh, I thought we were still role playing. Okay, go ahead. Take your time. Oh my God. I can't go over there. Hans, be careful. Oh, hell no. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Hey. I know jujitsu. I know jujitsu. Oh! Smile for the camera. No. Mm. Oh shit. I need to put old Bessie back where she belongs. Archives. Oh, what the? F Yo, I can't wait. Okay, so this is just a demo. Just to remind you. I can't wait for this full game to drop. One day this hole appeared in the wall. It's crazy of strange. That's a draft, and I can see the other side, which should be impossible. Let's check our messages. Yeah, that's Jeff, you know, from the factory. Oh, yeah, Jeff. Hey, I heard that you quit last week. Hope you're doing okay. Quit? I would do no such thing. Can I miss you now that it's just me and the lung cats? Lunkheads are crazy. Well, give me a call soon, man. Maybe we can get a drink and watch the game sometime. Sure, Jeff. I'll do that. Hope you're doing well. I'll see ya. <gasps> bye bye. Jeff, that annoying bastard. I met while undercover for a mission. How did he track my number? Perhaps he isn't as innocent in it. Oblivious as I suspected. Blah. Blah. Old files from past missions. More old files from past missions. Funny. I can't seem to remember what I put in here. Blah. 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 It's locked, though. Let's go put old Betsy up. I don't like going back there anymore. So I'm not gonna put her back there. Where the hell do you want me to put her? Alright. Now it's time for some casserole. Blah. I lost my appetite, so never mind. It doesn't smell right. I should probably throw it away, but I'm just gonna leave it here. Let me do it. Oh. Agent, you orders directly from the Pentagon. Make the Pentagon? The fun side carnival. You will receive further information upon your arrival. Okay. Fun side carnival. That's a goal. So, our, wait, if we work for the Pentagon, that means we're a bad person. Agent D. Reed, your mission is to find a vantage point over the carnival. Take out the person wearing the werewolf costume. Vantage point werewolf costume. All right. I'm so happy to have another mission.
Well, well, well. I think there are only two, two options here. The Ferris wheel or that green thing over there. Lookout tower. Can I talk to, in, to any of the NPCs? Hey, amigo, are you interested in Pablo's red hot peppers? Red hot peppers? They're great as a topping, I assure you. A topping for what? I don't think so, man. Is that Jay? No. Where's the werewolf? No. Ah, so you're the guy, huh? Let's see, are you gonna be standing here the whole time? Or is it you? No, that's not a werewolf. That's a dude. There are children here. You, you've been to Epstein Island, ain't you, boy? Yo, lock him up immediately. Why is he not my target? All right, let's get out of here. Well, I do work for the Pentagon, so it makes sense for him not to be my target. Your target is a wolf in sheep's clothing. Much like the spy you had to intercept last week, they are responsible for the deaths of many innocents. Avenge innocents and protect our national security. We will allow no other casualties. What's easy? <laughs> what? Did any? Nobody saw so what's me. What's the plan, boss? This doesn't feel like a homework assignment. Wait, what? You gonna fill me in on why two journalism students are at a murder scene on a school night? Just do what you're paid to do, Clyde. <laughs> but I get paid nothing. Exactly. Right. So do nothing and stay quiet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> quiet. Come on, Gail. From a somewhat friendly acquaintance to a somewhat friendly acquaintance. Why are we here? <sighs> ah. Is this about Pamela? Yeah. I, I don't understand. You think this is related? Oh. I don't know anything, Clyde. I think I see where the story is headed. That's why we're here, to ask around, see what exactly happened. I have a bad feeling about this. I hope I'm wrong, but I don't think Pamela was the last victim of this psychopath. All right, fine. Snoop around. I'll get some shots of the Ferris wheel or something. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Clyde. I really do appreciate you coming with me. Excuse me, officer. Whoa, sorry, kid. There's sort of a murder investigation going on right now. You'll have to wait until tomorrow to get on the rides. I'm not a... Look, officer, who's in charge here? Why are you asking? I think I might have some important information. Oh, yeah? I doubt that. But, like, if you're you, I don't give a shit. So go on in. <laughs> Man, he loves his job. He's probably a couple of days from Look retirement. Guy with a cigar, that's Detective Dutch. That guy with a cigar. Oh God, that bullet destroyed. It. Uh, uh, oh, I don't need to be here. I gotta get out of here. Oh, uh, no, no. What was my uh camera guy's name? I forgot. Damn it. <laughs> Why are you still here? 
Detective, I think there's a killer on the loose, and I doubt this is the last we'll see of him. You can't just go around saying that. I mean, hell, we just wrapped up the Womb Ripper killings, and now you're saying that some maniac is running around the city with a rifle shooting random people. Because it would be random, wouldn't it? No. It doesn't have to be at all. Did your friend and this Mr. Richard Sanchez lying next to me have anything in common? Not that I'm aware of. No serial killer. End of story. <laughs> Unless you can find me proof otherwise. Now beat it. Go chase a story more on your level. Like why my asshole itches on Thursday nights. Probably because you eat too much Taco Bell. It's Taco Thursday! What the hell? Sniper killer? You mean the guy behind these murders? East 7th Street, 2 a.m. Tonight. What do you know? We will see you then, Miss Jenkins. Was that the Pentagon? The guy who... I'm definitely on to something here. I have to see what this person knows. I have to do it for Pam! Dutch, you don't have a clue. Oh. Excuse me, miss. Yeah? The name's Comedy. Detective Comedy. I overheard your conversation with my colleague back there. I'm intrigued. Here's my card. Why are you telling me this? I doubt anything we say will keep you away. So, might as well keep in contact with you. If you really do end up finding anything you think we should know about, don't hesitate to call us. All right, I will. Thanks, Detective. Detective Comedy. Well, looks like you didn't Clyde, get arrested, that's so name. that's good. <laughs> Clyde. Clyde grew up to be a cameraman? Hey, you look like you've just seen a ghost. What's up? Are you up for a little ride? Well, considering you're in my van, yeah, I guess so. Good. I think I might have our first lead. So, this is where they told you to meet them? Yeah, he's 7th Street. Yeah. Seems suspect to me. Very. Well, what else am I supposed to do? Uh, go home and go to bed? The fuck? Not let strange people lure you to a perfect <laughs> place to be murdered? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean... You're just looking for any action, huh? Go shoot some footage or something. I'll give them ten minutes. If no one shows up, we leave. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Damn. Why is it always so foggy in the city? Feels like we're in Gotham. Crimes against Pisa Man up to 75% from last year. So this is all within the same world as the last game. Which I thought the last game was Night, uh, Night at the Gates of Hell, but I forgot they did Ding Dong Dead, and I didn't even play that game. Hello? Is, is someone there? <laughs> That window's open. Clyde? I'm afraid to move. Hey, Gail. You have a handkerchief. Mind wiping this smudge off my lens? Oh, no. Sure, I got it. I knew it! I knew it! Oh! 
I'm sorry. Please. Please. Uh, 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 serpentine. Shit. No. I've got to get off the street. No, serpentine. Serpentine. Uh, okay. Okay, can I go in here? No, get ah 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 ah. Subway, subway, subway. Ah ah ah! Serpentine, what the fuck is? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I better keep moving and find some help. That psychopath might be looking for me. In here. It's locked. Fuck. Through here? No. Anything. Insert coin. Luckily, I have a quarter. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Insert! Oh god. Hurry! Hurry! Uh, 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 uh. Oh god, it's following me! Uh, oh no! Out of order! Enter! Enter! Oh! Uh, uh, one of these. Come on. Come on. No, uh, no, 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 no. It's the only one I can go in. Oh no! This isn't good. This is too much. I need to find a phone and call the police. They take forever to respond to anything in this city. I'll call that Detective Camardi. I still have his card. He seemed really serious. You've got to be kidding me. Must have used my last quarter on that damn gate. Maybe the gods will smile down on me today, and I can find a quarter. Oh. Please. Oh, maybe it is my lucky guy. The gods. Oh! <sighs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Pick up, pick up, pick up. Detective Camardi? Who is this? The killer. He's here with me. I'm on East 7th on the subway platform. This is a That's that motherfucker from the Pentagon. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go.
That was a close call. Poor Clyde. I need to sit down and think this through. Hey, hey, yo, yo, hey, 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 sniper killer, drug dealer, cocaine stealer, drug killer, all in the same boat, gotta have me some tote, don't stay asleep. You gotta stay woke. Come on, folks, get it together. Look outside. Look at the weather. <laughs> Yo. That was good. That's a, that's a good demo. That's a really good demo. I uh, can't wait to play this one. I meant to sit in and see how deep it goes. I hope it goes as deep as night. Uh, night at the gates of hell. Knights at the gates of hell. Cause that that game was deep. That game was pretty fucking deep. Um, as far as like storyline goes. So I hope this one is as deep. Cause Jordan King has been talking about this one on his Twitter for a while. So that's why I've been I've I've been keeping my eye on this one. Plus recently, Puppet Combo their actual page talked about they're releasing a game soon. And this definitely has to be it. So that's why we're playing this one. I hope y'all enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Much love. Stay blessed.